Hello lovely people, how are you guys doing? What's up? <laughs> Today we're trying out celebrity recipes Pasta recipes to be a little more specific Let's see which one wins Rihanna or Kylie Jenner This was supposed to be suspenseful sound effect or something, I don't know Which one makes better? Today we're finding out. Come on, you know you like those sound effects. DIY sound effects. <laughs> Bye, Danny. <laughs> Anyways. Pew, 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 pew. Oh my god, pasta. Guys, we're making pasta today. We're swimming in my comfort zone. Come on, let's swim together. The water is nice and warm here. <laughs> I don't know how to swim. I'm gonna need this. That's a big tomato. I'm gonna start off with Kylie's recipe just because it requires a little more effort. It's a little more extra. So I'm gonna start off by cutting my beautiful potatoes. Potatoes? <laughs> that, that's tomato, Denny. Now in her Instagram story, when she was making this recipe, she said that she used potatoes. <laughs> oh my God, the struggle is real. I'm not allowed to say the word potato anymore. Potato, tomato, tomato, potato, it's the same thing, okay? The only difference is that you don't wanna eat the one of them raw. It's the potato. <laughs> she said that she used um, tomatoes from her garden. Kylie in her Instagram story. These tomatoes that I have right here are from my grocery store and they're a little rotten because they were supposed to be eaten like a week ago, maybe even two weeks ago, I don't know. They're not in their best shape, that's what I'm trying to say. Don't you even dare come close to my shirt, okay? gonna add some olive oil some olive oil salt some pepper oh i think i added a little too much pepper it's gonna be a little hot and now i need a spoon <laughs> spatula will also work this smells like childhood summer days in grandma's house in the countryside very specific i know all right guys now this is flying into the oven because i'll need to bake it for 30 minutes at 200 200 degrees celsius let's go i mean it's already there so i don't know i don't know where i'm supposed to go <laughs> well i can't cut it with this now i need to dice an onion oh hi denny what's up <laughs> Well, I wasn't expecting that. Please don't make me cry. Please don't hurt my feelings. I once saw a video where Gordon Ramsay was showing us how to cut an onion. Ever since then, I got so many compliments on my onion cooking skills. Mainly by my um, grandma. So I don't know if it counts. Hold on, I need to be... Oh, I need to be quick with the onion. Stop it. Onion, stop it. It's so weird how onion can just... Oh. I came to the conclusion that onions have two superpowers. Whee! Mm -hmm. The one is making food taste better. The second one, summoning tears. They make you pay for that good flavor with your tears. <laughs> <laughs> Who's crying now, onion? Who's crying now? <laughs> You're not winning this one, onion. Ooh. That went on my curtain. How unfortunate. Hey, guess who's back? Carrots! Carrots on fire! You guys, the onion is being a little too dramatic. It's still making me cry. My eyes burn. Now I'm gonna dice some carrots and some celery. Ugh, I don't like celery. 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 How to pronounce celery? Celery. <laughs> I don't like celery, but you know what I like? Celery. <laughs> Come on guys, let's go in the kitchen. We all know what happened the last time I tried turning my studio into a kitchen. That was my hunt, I promise you, I didn't fart. See, here, listen. Don't betray me like that. <laughs> there is not that much to do in the kitchen, I just need to cook the vegetables and once they're soft, add some garlic. Cook a little more and that's basically it. Well, 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 look who is flying back to us. Woo. Careful tomatoes, <laughs> careful with the landing. The tomatoes are back from the oven and oh my god, they look really well cooked. Good job tomatoes, good job. Just to show you how extra just to show you how extra this recipe is. There we go. Oh my god, finally untangled my tongue. I used the oven, a stove, 
a second stove and now I'm about to use a blender. Kylie, that's way too many steps. <laughs> that's how you know she's not the one washing the dishes after all that cooking. Why well, I'm always using blender in my videos. reminds me of the feta pasta from TikTok. Oh, I'm gonna tell you guys a little secret. If you decide to try out the feta pasta from TikTok, which you definitely should because it's an amazing recipe, everybody should try out. I'm still making it at home. What I would suggest you to do is once you bake the feta with the tomatoes, you put them in a blender. That's how you make the best sauce for pasta, in my opinion. Because if you don't blend it and you just press it with a fork, as the video suggests, there is tomato skin all over the place. It's 100 times better if you blend it. <laughs> We're gonna add some dried oregano. It doesn't really say how much, so I'm just gonna... Meh. Maybe I can add a little more. The recipe also calls for some fresh basil, but... Why would they do that? Uh... That was a trap! This is some dried basil. I know that it's not as good as the fresh one, but that's what I have available, okay? Don't judge me. How much? I don't know. I feel like I'm over salting everything. Just like I'm overthinking everything. Our Kylie sauce now needs to take a break, have a rest, take a nap. It's been working so much today. I'll need to leave this to the side for a couple of minutes just to let the ingredients tie, tight, tie, tie, tie together. So yeah, I'm just gonna... Oh my god! <laughs> this was literally this close to a disaster. I'm gonna show you guys. Look at that! Those are my fingers for scale. Let's leave Kylie aside. Rihanna, come over here. It's your turn. Now we're gonna make Rihanna's mac a Reese. Obviously, I'm gonna start off with a pepper. I don't like peppers. They're not my favorite vegetable. I mean, to be fair, I don't really have a favorite vegetable anyways. Who has a favorite vegetable? No one comes to you asking, what is your favorite vegetable? Um, watermelon. <laughs> No, everybody's like, what is your favorite dessert? I know how to answer that question. Favorite vegetable though? I really need to think about it. And I don't like thinking. So in her Instagram story, we can see that she cuts the peppers like this. However, I know that if I cut the peppers like that, I'm not gonna like it. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna cut the paper, the papers, <laughs> the peppers into really tiny, small, cubes because i find that if the peppers are cut in a tiny pieces i can tolerate them but if they're bigger i'm like no nah. onions oh here we go again just one just a tiny little onion i'm afraid this one is a little <laughs> um it's a little bad bad boys bad boys what you gonna do yeah this one is good oh here we go again here we go again these are my onion glasses <laughs> All right, my friends, so here is how Rihanna makes her pasta. We're gonna add the pepper straight on top of the macaroni, white onion and spring onions as well. And this is what we have. It looks very healthy, but wait, we're not done. Wait until we add the cheese. What I'm about to do next can be easily considered crime against pasta. Pasta with ketchup, yeah, that's good. Pasta with mayo, weird, but delicious. I like. Mustard in pasta? I love Rihanna so much. I don't think that I like other celebrity more than her. But mustard in pasta? Rihanna, what? I'm just gonna blindly trust her and... I'm just gonna blindly trust her and add some mustard in my pasta. Yeah, maybe a little more. There we go. We'll also add some... Whoa, some ketchup. Ay, 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 ay. She must know something about the mustard that we don't, right? The mustard in the pasta is what actually inspired me to make this video, so thank you, Rihanna. This was easy so far. Peppers, ketchup, mustard, you know, all these ingredients are so easy to find. However, there is that one ingredient, the secret ingredient, which was so difficult for me to find. I couldn't find it anywhere. It's this. <laughs> I couldn't find this anywhere where I live. I looked literally everywhere for it. Local stores, online stores, every food store in Europe. I mean, online, nothing. <laughs> I was so desperate, I even looked under my couch. Sometimes stuff magically appear under there, but this time, nothing, just dirty socks. Not even Amazon was shipping it here. You know what that means? I had to pay a lot for it, that's what it means. And it expires in a month. <laughs> 
So yeah. <laughs> this is hot Jamaican scotch bonnet pepper sauce. I really hope I said everything right. Oh, this has a very strong scent. But I can't, I don't recognize this scent. New scent unlocked. Thanks, Rihanna. All right, and we're gonna put how much I'm supposed to put from this. This is hot and I don't like hot stuff. Hot one and a half tablespoon. But let's put this much. Is that a lot? Maybe a little more. How hot it can be. My tongue is numb. This was a very bad idea. Instant regret. <laughs> it broke my tongue. It was already broken. Now it's completely broken. Instant regret. That's what it was. <laughs> now I'm taking a bath in the kitchen. I'm gonna warm up my macaroni and I'm gonna add some cheese. Why does melted cheese look so good? Just give me melted cheese on pasta and let me live my life. Oh my god, this is so cheesy. Just like my jokes. <laughs> cheese in general is so good. It's unfair to all the other foods out there. Excuse me, cheese? How dare you be so delicious? My dad loves dairy. I think that love is not... It's not a strong enough word. It's on another level, okay? <laughs> and I think I got it from him. I can't live without dairy. Yogurt. How can you not like yogurt? Ha! <laughs> I tried cutting dairy because of my acne at some point. I didn't feel like myself. I lost my spark. It was bad. It was bad. I couldn't take it anymore. Those were the worst three days of my life. I feel like Kylie's recipe is a little more classic. Just some red tomato sauce with the pasta. Where Rihanna puts mustard in there. She's only using one pot for all of that. That's one point for me already. Oh my god, I boil pasta so well. All right, let's get some of that secret sauce. Ooh, la la. Oh my god, mm, the celery. It's the celery. We're gonna have an issue with it. I can already feel it. Cute. All right, guys, what do you think? Rihanna or Kylie? Which one is the winner? If you could guess right now. Sorry, my tablet decided to interrupt. If you could guess right now, which one do you think that will taste better? I'm gonna start off with Kylie's. I'm gonna try to mix my pasta in here, have a nice bite of everything that's going on. All right, here we go. Whoa, I'm so excited. Hmm, interesting. The tomato, I can feel the tomato. I'm gonna tell you in a while what I think about it. Now let's try Rihanna's. Oh my God, I really hope this is not too hot. It's not hot. Guys, I can eat this. It's just as hot as it should be. Hot enough that it's actually pleasant, not killing. Surprisingly, I don't really feel the mustard in there. Like, I don't feel weird mustard flavor. I was skeptical about the mustard. I'm not gonna lie. Mustard in pasta? Mm. It actually tastes like comfort food, like mom's food. Mom cooked dinner for all of us with love and added a touch of spiciness because dad loves spicy things. Not my dad, no, but I'm just trying to paint a picture for you how this tastes. This, however, ugh, uh, I don't like the celery. <laughs> I don't, I can't. I was hoping that the tomatoes with the parmesan and the pasta would cover the celery flavor, but it's still there and it's intense. Ah, uh, celery. I can see it in your eyes, you're judging me. To be completely honest with you guys, 100%, at the beginning of this video, when I first started filming it, I thought, I was almost certain that the Kylie's recipe would taste so much better because it's more classic pasta recipe. I was afraid of the unknown, the unknown being the Rihanna's recipe, but it turned out to be the better one. How? Oh, I can feel the spiciness in my throat. It's kicking. The Rihanna pasta is actually good. It's really, really good. All right. Wow. If you guys want to see me make a sponge cake, click on this video. And here I'm trying out some viral TikTok food trends. You can find me on Instagram, Facebook, TikTok. Thank you guys so, 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 so much for watching and hopefully I'll see you in my next one. Bye. Yeah.